So we are given wires which have linear charge density of lambda. We need to find the electric field at the centers. So let's break this wire into three parts, one, two, and three. Due to first part, field will be here, making at angle 45 degree with this line. So this we have seen before, why this happens. Now due to the wire three, field will be again at 45 degree with this line. So magnitudes are same and directions are opposite. So E1 and E3 will cancel each other. We'll be left with E2 that is due to this quarter circle. So the formula for a arc electric field due to an uh, due to arc at the center is kq by r square sine phi by 2 by phi by 2. So here value of phi will be 90 degree. And q will be lambda times arc length which is 2 pi r by 4. So just put these values here and you will get the answer. Now in this case, so again 1, 2, 3 due to the 2 it is upwards due to 1 at this angle due to 3 at this angle so you can see horizontal components will cancel out anyway so vertical components of 1 and 3 will get added up that should be 2 times e parallel and e parallel for a semi infinite rod is k lambda by r so this gives e1 plus e3 is equal to 2k two k lambda by r downwards now E2 due to the semicircular wire is this is the formula and the value of phi will be pi. So you, if you simplify you will get it 2k lambda by r again but this time the direction is upwards. So the magnitudes are same but directions are opposite so it will add up to be 0.